All media are extensions of some human faculty, mental or physical. The wheel is an extension of the foot. The book is an extension of the eye. Clothing is an extension of the skin. Electric circuitry is an extension of the central nervous system. The extension of any one sense displaces the other senses and alters the way we think, the way we see the world and ourselves. When these changes are made, men change. I am an eye, a mechanical eye. I, the machine, show your world the way only I can see it. I free myself for today and forever from human immobility. I'm in constant movement. I approach and pull away from objects. I creep under them. I move alongside a running horse's mouth. I fall and rise with the falling and rising bodies. This is I, the machine, maneuvering in the chaotic movements, recording one movement after another in the most complex combinations. Freed from the boundaries of time and space, I coordinate any and all points of the universe wherever I want them to be. My way leads towards the creation of a fresh perception of the world. Thus I explain, in a new way, the world unknown to you. Those words are from a manifesto written in 1923 by Ziga Vertov, the Russian film director. And the images are from a film he made in 1928 called The Man with a Movie Camera. The invention of the camera has changed not only what we see, but how we see it. And in a crucial but quite simple way, it has even changed paintings painted long before it was invented. The painting on the wall, like a human eye, can only be in one place at one time. The camera reproduces it, making it available in any size, anywhere, for any purpose. Botticelli's Venus and Mars used to be a unique image which it was only possible to see in the room where it was actually hanging. Now its image or a detail of it or the image of any other painting which is reproduced can be seen in a million different places at the same time. Sir boys, what is art? Kunst is this element de maneira geral, pode-se dizer que arte é o elemento no contexto do mundo através do qual o homem sente ser o centro criador de algo, o centro produtor de algo de novo. Evolucionário, então. O novo conceito de arte tornar-se-á realidade somente se for evolutivo. Qualquer pessoa é um artista. Make the secrets productive. Qualquer pessoa é um artista e tornai produtivos os segredos. Why, why should art and culture suddenly become very big business, like big science? Uh, the reasons are tied up with the fact that, in, that we're living in an information age. When you live in an information age, culture becomes big business, education becomes big business, and the cultural explosion or the information explosion becomes itself culture. It knocks down all the walls between culture and business. 